Hi, I'm coming to you today with a breath that really helped me uh, straighten out my spine from my scoliosis. So I'm gonna show you how to do this. So you either have a C curve or S curve. And the first thing that you wanna do is remember where your concavity is. And where your concavity is, you're gonna feel in your back. You wanna feel in the lower part of your back. So if you have an S, I realize that the concavity may be up here on the right, but it's also gonna be on the lower left. So wherever the concavity is in the lower part of the back, we're gonna take, I have a yoga block here, and I use a yoga block because it helps me sit with my spine straight. So you wanna sit on something where you can sit with your spine straight, like not up against the back of a chair or anything. And I've got this, this, um, this towel here I'm gonna sit on. Now my concavity is in my, in my lower left. So I'm gonna sit with this under my right, my right side butt is gonna sit on this. Now, if you're the opposite, you'll just do everything the opposite from me. So seated, lips closed. Just take a breath for a moment. It's a shorter inhale than an exhale. All right, now when we breathe in, imagine wherever your concavity is, you're, you're gonna breathe in like you're blowing up a balloon, okay? You're gonna create some pressure in the ribs. Here we go, inhale. Puff out into your areas, wherever your areas are, your concavities, and hold the pressure, hold that pressure. It's gonna feel like a lot of pressure in those ribs. Now exhale, slow through the nose. Good, let's do that one more time. Puffing up, inhaling, pressurizing and holding. Hold that pressure. Exhale, slow. Close lips. All right, so you can see just breathing with me. But I'm gonna show you how this works also in some of my favorite spinal lengthening poses. So I'd love to do this in a forward fold. This is what it would look like. You wanna have your uh, knees bent so that you can rest your ribs on your thighs, let your head hang. And then again, I'm going to breathe into the concavities. So wherever your concavities are, the, the weaker points are kind of indented in. Puff out like you're blowing up a balloon. Stretch into those ribs and hold. And then exhale slow. Now let's say you're in a down dog position. So because my, my concavity is on the left, I'm gonna take my left foot back and my right hand forward, just a couple of inches, just a couple of inches. It's gonna be a little awkward because you're offset. Now I'm gonna breathe in again, breathe in, lips closed, puff out into the concavities and hold the pressure. And then exhale slow. Excellent. And so we come on out and keep breathing. Keep breathing, keep stretching, keep moving. Best way to work out that spine and get it a little bit straighter. I don't even have to hem the left pant leg anymore because this has worked so well. So if you have any questions, leave those in the comments and I will get back to you. Okay, best wishes always, and I will see you soon.